places across the British Isles have been taking part in a project called There But Not There, where transparent silhouettes are installed to help people understand the loss felt by communities a hundred years ago. Charlie Frost reports. Colour Sergeant Major Henry Birkby. Lieutenant Philip Bisson. The Jersey men who never came home. Tonight they rejoined their parish congregation through art. These spectral figures remind us that although the people we love have gone from us, they have not left us completely. On our war memorial we have some 46 names of people who lived in this local area and who died in the First World War. Now a hundred years ago, um, you know, everybody used to go to church, not like now, but uh, back in the day they all did. Um, and so it's pretty reasonable to assume that those men who we remember um, actually at different stages in their lives will have been in this very church and will have sat in the pews where, where our congregations sit today. Sitting shoulder to shoulder with the First World War soldiers who belong to their community. These perspex cutouts are to encourage islanders to think about the reality of war, the reality of loss, the reality of the gaps left in St Luke's parish and in the hearts and homes of Jersey families. Bear in mind that when they left the island there was no more communication. Very little information got back. It was very sporadic, so people waved their men goodbye and they weren't sure whether they were coming back or not, and a lot of them didn't. And while it may be impossible for us to understand such loss, this installation may help bring home the impact it would have had on our islands. Charlie Frost, ITV News.